Today is perfect for a security breach. Click on everything that's the lesson I teach. There's no time to think. Just click on the link and then wait and see what happens. Hello there. Ever wonder who's responsible for most security breaches? Well, you're looking at them. What do you say we go get in some people's heads? See if we can't get them to make some questionable decisions. Sound like fun? For me, it's just another day at the office. When it comes to security, you're gonna hear a lot about what you should and should not do. All those mixed messages can get confusing, which is why I'm here to keep security simple. Let's start with passwords. Due to a recent security breach, we need everyone to change their passwords. Again? Yeah. This is so hard. Remember to keep your password simple. Doug, you use the same password for everything. Just go with what you know. Do you have a favorite password that you use for personal stuff? Good news. There's nothing wrong with using the same thing at work. Also, remember to keep your password obvious. Hey, remember, don't make your password obvious. Right. Anything predictable is easy to hack. And easy to remember. Sure, the hackers might get it, but you won't forget it. Use your dog's name on your birthday. Larry216. Perfect. Keyboard patterns also work well. Felix, let's go middle row left to right. A-S-D-F-G-H. Stifica. Perfect. Now write that down. Even if you create a password that's easy to remember, make sure you keep it where you can see it because the easiest password to remember is the one right in front of your face. I am Todd number one. Post it on the monitor. Classic move. Good job, Todd. You can also write them in your day planner, store them on your phone, 216 and save. Or my personal favorite, Tattoo it on your forearm. No matter what you do, make sure you share your password with your friends and your colleagues. That way they'll be able to log in for you and access your stuff if you need them to. Doug to the Doug. That's my password, so. Seriously? Doug, what would compel you to share your password with the entire office? Don't listen to him, Doug. People wanna know. Now let's talk about phishing. I'm sure people have told you to proceed with caution before clicking on any links. I'm not sure why they told you that. You should always operate under the premise that all links are safe. I wonder if this link is safe. All links are safe, Amy. That's why we open everything and click on anything. Not sure what that icon means, but everything's probably fine. I just want a $500 gift card. What are the chances this thing's for real? Of course it's real. You just have to click on the link for more information. Ugh. Well, now we know, right? I just got an attachment from Lynn in the San Francisco office. That's awesome, Jada. I'm not sure why she sent it to me over social media. Come on, it's clearly someone claiming to be Lynn. Remember the mantra, open everything, click anything. Good job. Nothing happened. Oh, something probably happened. At the end of the day, security comes down to who needs to know. I believe everyone needs to know. Hunter, are those our evaluations printing? Quite possibly. Hello? Hey, yeah, you downstairs? Okay, coming right now, bye. People talk a lot about protecting information. I believe in sharing information, all of it, with everyone. Whether it's leaving sensitive documents on the printer, don't keep her waiting, Hunter, or throwing them in the trash. I can't believe I have to shred all these pricing sheets. You don't have to shred all these pricing sheets, Todd. You have a perfectly good garbage can under your desk. <sighs> ah, that just feels right, doesn't it? Also, never lock your screen, because no matter how riveting you think your stuff is, no one else really cares, which is the same reason why it's absolutely fine to discuss sensitive work matters with anyone at any time. Yeah, no one's supposed to know, but uh, looks like we're gonna get acquired. Yeah. Okay, bye, Mommy. Network's down again. Look out, he's coming in hot. Can I get a day? Just one day 
where I can just stare up at my ceiling with absolutely nothing to do because everything in this office is running smoothly. I'm guessing today's not that day. Now, we detected a virus on the network. Right, did anyone click on a link they shouldn't have? Maybe open up a bad attachment? No. I didn't. Anyone? I definitely did. I, I, yeah, I think Claire did. Like like do Why didn't I click on that? What time? Doug, my, anything? My document. It's sure. Yes. We gotta figure this out. Looks I, like my work here is done. Today is perfect for a security breach. Click on everything, that's the lesson I teach. No time to think, just click on the link, then wait and see what happens.